all right so i am standing in my closet you guys and the space is tight in here um so i don't know how much you'll be able to see as i work um but i've so far i've already as you saw from the previous clip pull everything from underneath now i'm going to pull everything from up top and i'm also going to start rearranging the clothes um this is going to be quite the adventure i don't know i signed up for a lot y'all sorry i'm looking for i have some oh here they are and i just waste half of them on the floor rubber bands for my hair i just turned the air on because i'm hot already and i just started I took my hair down last night because it was just itching too bad and I needed to be able to get in there and moisturize it. It's time to get it redone. I just haven't made the appointment yet, but it's growing good and I'm happy with that. So I'm on my lunch break, so I, I can't do too much, but let's see what we can get done. That it's going to be hard for you to really be able to see you know what I mean <clears throat> I love this hat but with these locks my head is just too big look at all that space up there we got extra hangers all kind of stuff And I have shoes up in the shoe, these shoe boxes. But I'm gonna tell you, out of sight, out of sight, out of mind. If I can't see them, I don't ever think about them. So I think I'm gonna get rid of the shoe boxes. And just like my boots, those were Nikes that are already out there somewhere. Just like my boots, these are so cute, y'all. These are super cute. Aren't these cute? Never wear them because I don't see them. So I'm going to put all my shoes. And I know you can't see me. Maybe I could turn you around. Can you see that? I'm just throwing the boxes over your head. Everything that's long, this is cute. This is a mustard yellow jumpsuit, you guys. This is going to be in the fashion show. It is beautiful. It's still got the tag on it somewhere. Still got the tag on it. I bought it to wear to an event that I never got to go to because of all the stuff that's happening so i'm excited for that super cute this is a maxi dress i know i'm keeping that oh i love this if i still have the picture i'll post a picture of me wearing that this is so cute it's a linen dress it's so cute it's like a man's shirt in a dress and it's purple or lavender and linen so cute this is cute too this is also linen it flares at the bottom so cute <gasps> my jumpsuit I have two of these this is a jumpsuit and I have this color 
where's the other color? I'll show it to you when I get to it. Here's a jumpsuit too. This is a jumpsuit and this goes around my head. It's uh, the pants were too long and my mother cut off the pants and hem them and the excess she used to make a sash that I put around my head. It's so cute. Oh, here's the other jumpsuit, you guys. You know, working from home, you forget about all your clothes. I love it. I'm just giving you a sneak peek. I love this jumpsuit. Different colors. Where's the other one? Yes. When I love something, I'll buy multiple colors. So this is a long flowy dress. And this is the other color. And I do have pictures of these. I'll put them in right here. All right, so let me show you what we have here. So over here we have long dresses and jumpsuits. And then over here we have coats. So I just put everything over here. I'm gonna go through and color code them um, as best I can. But I wanted all the long stuff here. So that would leave this long row for shirts, skirts, and pants. And then you'll be able to see what's underneath the bottom. Now I still see some long items. I will arrange those by length. I'm also gonna do my best to color code the closet. Might prove difficult because I have a lot of colorful stuff, but that is what we're looking like right now. I'm gonna take a break because my lunch is over and I have to get back to work, but we've made progress. And as long as this looks like this, I have to finish today. So, <sighs> okay, you guys, I had a few more minutes on my break. So I went through and tried to color code as best I could. Um, everything in the black family, then blue. Got a gray in there. Then those are the reds. The purples and pinks and then we get into the oranges and yellows and then the browns and lighter colors so I knew it wasn't gonna just look that easy because of all the prints and then I probably should have started with black but this gray coat is the longest coat I have it is a trench coat even though it has black fur it is gray this brown trench is next to the longest and then I started the blacks, purples, reds, pinks, and then those over there. So that's what we have done so far. I'm really pleased with how it's gonna look. It even feels bigger in here to me because I moved all of those long items over there. So let's see how it goes.
Let me show you what we got here. So this was the floor. And let me show you what happened to it. Those items over there. Those three bags. And this half a bag is all purge items. Good items that somebody can use. So these two and a half bags are clothes. All of these bags are hangers. Then we have trash right here. All of this is trash. So to all total, what, one, two, three, four, five and a half bags came out of here. Bam, my closet is done. I still got my jewelry right here, as I said in an earlier clip. Um, all of these are earrings. I also have my mother's old jewelry on where I please excuse the tape. We, this was taped up when we brought it here because it was full of stuff. And it's a nice armoire. It's just a little beat up. I'm seriously thinking about sanding it down and painting it a different color. Maybe the gray that I did my dresser right there. Um, but it's full of jewelry. I love jewelry. Don't get to wear it too often. But it is full of jewelry. The drawers and both sides of the armoire right and this has a mirror raises up and there's jewelry in there too this is cleaned off all of this change came off the floor i dropped the earring somewhere two earrings i think i have the other one of this and never could find that i finally found it and then this one i know i dropped i think it's under the armoire but i left it here this is an old picture of my husband's mother i found it and i want to keep it um, so let's talk about the closet. This section right here are dresses that go all the way to the floor or long, you know, well, long dresses. So I put those in this corner to get them from over here and create a bigger space. Next to the dresses are coats and jackets. I started from the longest to the shortest because I have a three-piece luggage set back there. That's my luggage set and each piece fits inside the other. Then we have dress suits, skirts, pants, and tops, and just a few other sweaters here. It opened up all of this space for me and I was super excited. This clothes basket is temporary at some point I think I'm gonna get another one of these or something that matches it for all of my purses and then I had a quilt that I just stuck on top I need baskets like that the square baskets are what actually fit in here I have some of those but I'm using it in the storage room so I'm gonna get some more and replace these two because they're too long they pull out on the bottom I have an overflow of shoes and my workout suits I have two workout suits under there that help you to sweat all of our sheets are here and some other items that I just wanted to put away this is all winter stuff um, all of my shawls are on top 
like three shawls are on top and then on the bottom we have hats and scarves and gloves in that basket I didn't really have anything to put up here but I have those cubes that I got from Fab Fit Fun both of those came from Fab Fit Fun one is a travel bag and the other is the three piece cubes didn't have anywhere to stick those just yet so I just set them on top this is something that I have for my mom I have to give it to her so that's there um, there was nothing in that space I had some extra hangers and my scarf hanger I'll show you what I did with my scarf in a minute um, I also changed out and I need to get that blue one changed out all of my hangers I had like four different color hangers now I only have the black and the leopard print uh, my, all my stuff is on black and leopard print hangers up top and I actually got rid of half of my scarves those are scarves in the basket and then I had some extra sweatshirts that are on, just sitting on top I'm going to move those I don't like those there this is a basket full of knickknacks my blow dryer um, a makeup bag I'm not using uh, a Clarisonic face brush I have three of them that's an extra one the smaller basket here those are my small crossbodies if you remember they were all hanging on the door I moved them and put them in there because they fit perfectly and then there are sandals and winter boots right there so I am so proud of myself you guys I feel like I did an amazing job in one day and I'm so excited that it turned out this way I feel organized I feel like my chaos is organized so at some point I'll make it all match whether it's another cube and the right baskets or what I'll make it all matched but for now I feel better about my space the only thing that I feel pressed to do is stain this and color it so DIY coming soon I'm also going to get some new hardware to put on it but hey we can see the floor you guys all right so that is mobile home organization process two the master closet is done thank you guys so much for watching have a great day